Well, I'm back down here in the patio, and uh, I just got the G gauge loop here in the backyard running. Uh, let's go take a look at it. Uh, I built this loop uh, over 20 years ago, and I haven't run it for probably about three years now. A, when I started this a few weeks ago, or a week or so ago, the thing was completely overgrown. I mean, you couldn't even see the tracks, except for this back end where we don't get no light and didn't grow there. But all this in here was completely overgrown and completely covered. Uh, now I had to take all the buildings off, and they will go back on eventually, and 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 some other details. But uh, as of right now. It's back and it's and it's running. So uh, anyway, uh, let's ride. Let's watch it run. Well, I still got some cleaning up to do uh, with the locomotive and a tender. Uh, the choo-choo sounds not not too clear. It's kind of sporadic. I think it has to do with some some dirt. Uh, but anyway, I haven't run these things for for a number of years now, so uh, the fact that they even run is amazing. So uh, be nice to get a a live steam engine like Terry up in Vancouver has, and maybe we'll do that someday. But for now, I'm just happy to have my little G-Gauge running. Well, thanks for visiting my backyard happy spot. And uh, thanks for watching the video. We'll see you in the next one.